guys, this is Joe. Um, today we're going to be talking about um, maybe you have felt that um, you've been disconnected from your acting career and that can happen um, from what I see in our community um, in two types of situations. So first, um, you may feel disconnected in, or disillusioned because um, you haven't found work, you haven't found the kind of work you want. And um, so you've put a lot of effort in your acting career, you've invested a lot of time and money and passion, and you're not getting the type of results you want. And so um, in a way, you're kind of feeling disconnected because you kind of want to quit. You may not be wanting to admit that to yourself, but um, you're taking some distance. You're being a little aloof to it so that it hurts a little bit less so that you feel the pain more. And another situation um, that I'm also seeing in our community uh, when actors walk in is that you may be having um, a lot of work, um, a lot of credits, you're working all the time, and you're feeling disconnected because the dream that you had for acting is not providing the fulfillment that you were hoping you were going to reach when you started. So um, that's definitely frustrating in both cases because you're putting effort and you're either getting the results and it's not providing the satisfaction or you're not getting the results and it's also not providing the satisfaction. So in both cases, there's pain. And therefore, there's a little bit of resentment and fulfillment and you're feeling disconnected because it's not providing you um, the goodies that you were going for, right? Um, so it's definitely frustrating and you may have tried, you know, to um, find another job to really, yeah, like quit or you may have tried actually more acting classes to give yourself a last chance, that kind of thing. And yet it's still doesn't feel fulfilling because even if you're disconnected from it, there's this inside hunger under it that's still craving for acting. So the way that I am going to um, explore this topic with you is from um, the root perspective. So uh, what's usually happening, and you might not have been conscious of that or clear about why you entered acting in the first place. And usually we enter acting or the disciplines we go into a little bit young and um, you know we have that much experience as um, young souls, young lives and so you may have entered acting um, with the desire for recognition, with the desire to impress, with the desire to get validation, with the desire to get love and safety and worth from being seen, from being good at it, from being successful, from being famous. And um, when you're going to acting from that hungry lack perspective in order to fill your void, you're expecting an external uh, source to fill you up. And whenever you're going to do that, you're going to be disappointed because it always has to come from the inside. And if you're consuming things in order to fill you up, you're looping inside of the illusion that it's the things out there, the money, the cars, the women, the men, the relationships, the stuff, you know, the food, the alcohol, the drugs, whatever it is, the career, the celebrity, the jobs, the bookings, that is going to make you feel better, that is going to fill you up, that is going to give you the value as a person, that is going to build your identity, that is going to make you who you are. And actually, none of the things out there are to be consumed. The things out there are to be fed. So it's how you show up to give yourself to your endeavor that will fill you up. It's about service. It's about you showing up for acting, for your characters, for the story. It's not about you showing up in your acting career so that you 
will fulfill your ego's needs so that you will find validation, so that you will find safety, so that you will find worth, so that you will find love, so that you will find, keep going, the list is endless, right? So it's really about actually revisiting when you're feeling disconnected. It's an opportunity for you to revisit and dig a little deeper rather than escape the loop that you're in and find another you know, numbing activity that's going to give you the sensation that you're going to fill yourself up. It's really about actually taking magnifying glasses and start to dig in and go, okay, all right, I'm either not getting the credits or the jobs that I want or any job, or I'm getting all the jobs and yet I'm still looping in dissatisfaction and I'm still not feeling worthy. So, so what's going on? And that's your opportunity to actually um, unearth the fact that you have counted on um, acting to fulfill you. You've come to it as a consumer rather than as a provider, right? And so as soon as you're going to do that, you're going to be dependent on something exterior to you and therefore you're giving away your power. Um, your whole being, your full being, you are worthy, you are present, you are at peace, you are safe, you have value. That's a given. That's given to you when you're born. That's who you are in your essence. And none of the things that you're going to do or achieve out there are going to give you that. So it's not about looking for what's missing inside of you out there. It's really about realizing what is always already there and so that is the work that we're doing in our community it's not about teaching you something else that will make you a good actor or that will improve you or even grow you people talk a lot about growth and and that means that you're coming from a standpoint that you're an unfinished product in the beginning and you're not you're not a being that needs to grow you can expand, but there's nothing to grow. You're a finished product. You were born full, present, truthful, and then conditioning comes on top of it, and you start behaving in ways that are not truthful to you in order to get the safety and the validation, and in order for, for the love to keep coming, you conform, and you start behaving not like yourself. So, um, yeah, if this makes sense to you and if you're wanting to start digging and start recuperating, actually reclaiming your authentic and free self, like the real version of you, not a better version of you, not um, an improved version of you, not a version of you that's thirsty for an external authority or a guru or teacher to tell you how to do things, but to actually reclaim your capacity to be truthful and free at all times to reconnect with that because you already have it then definitely um, get in touch with us you can send us the dm um, and let us know if that's interesting to you we can send you to the wait list we can uh, let you know when we open enrollment we can send you some free resources if you go into the link in the bio or in the about section on facebook you'll find a um, free training that's called uh, stop trying to be a good actor so that you have a chance at being great and um, that's free so you can download that for now and there's a lot of content on instagram on facebook for you to already start moving that needle but if you want to do a deeper dive, definitely get in touch with us and let us know and we can send you some information. All right. Thank you guys. Happy Monday.